When the Florida Department of Transportation District 1 was faced with an urgent need to protect the existing seawalls running along the Skyway's South Fishing Piers access road, while also combating threats of sea level rise upon the broader Tampa Bay area, the agency opted for a new approach of breakwater construction. FDOT advertised a design-build project that mandated the design and construction of two breakwaters that would attenuate a minimum of 70% of wave energy and rise to a minimum elevation of approximately three feet above the waterline. In addition, the breakwaters were required to collectively foster nearly six acres of seagrass growth to satisfy FDOT's future seagrass mitigation needs. Trans Systems served as prime designer and engineer of record to contractor Vasilio and Grogan Incorporated to design, permit, and construct two breakwaters that would meet the specific requirements set forth by FDOT. The team proposed an innovative solution utilizing proprietary wave attenuation devices, better known as WADs, for the breakwaters. The WADs are pyramid-shaped precast concrete structures with triangular openings that attenuate up to 90% of the wave energy while promoting marine and seagrass growth. Despite their roughly 20 years of being used in various locations around the country, the design-build team's use of the WADs for this project marks the first time any state or federal level agency in the U.S. has deployed them. Compared to traditional rubble riprap breakwaters, the proposed system has proven to be faster, better, and cheaper method of constructing breakwaters while also creating an area where residents and visitors alike will be able to snorkel and see all the fish and marine life for years to come.